Happy Saturday morning, everyone. We're here in Enigma, Georgia, getting ready to go pick some blackberries, and we are at Southern Grace Farms. So Southern Grace Farms, it's a Georgia certified farm market and part of the Georgia Growing Program. Part of the attraction at Southern Grace Farms is why the adults are out picking blackberries and other fruits and vegetables here. There is a playground for kids to play on. Of course, it's closed right now due to the, the virus across the country. This is something that keeps kids occupied. Indoors, Southern Grace Farms has a market store. So you can see all sorts of different stuff here. I'm not going to go over each individual item. I'm just going to do a pan around the store. Stuff they have for sale. Interesting place. It's my first time here. We made it to the blackberry patch. So I'll scan it right here. I didn't count the number of rows, but this side over here they say is sweeter than this side over here. This side's a little bit tartar, so we'll get some of both. They do charge you by the pound. Uh, I do not remember how much it is per pound, so I'll drop that in later when I go to editing. So let's get to picking some blackberries. Okay, the family's all spread out in rows, and I'm coming up on the row with Aunt Till. And just, uh, if y'all remember the video where John and Andrew were shooting skeets over the pond, uh, Aunt Till's the one that actually owns that pond in that field there. So this town we're in, Enigma, is halfway between where Aunt Till lives and where we live, so we met halfway and we're spending some family time together. Well, we was coming to Morvan, Georgia, to Lawson's Peach Shed to pick peaches, but their you pick orchard is closed, so no picking peaches today. After buying some peaches and eating some peach ice cream, we headed over to Lake Park, Georgia, to Coggins Farms and picked. Uh, didn't pick. We bought some green butter beans and some cranberry beans, and you can see those right here. This is our final haul for the day. You can see the blackberries on the left, the peaches and a watermelon there on the bottom right, and see the green butter beans and the cranberry beans at the top. So that's the, our haul for today. So we're going to be eating good for a while. Okay, here we are. It's May 28th. Uh, these were planted on April the 19th. So we're fixing to make our first harvest of cucumbers. And there it is. It's cucumber number one. And banana pepper number one. So here's the first plate of cucumbers. You want to let it go to waste. Uh, she has already sliced that thing up and got salt and pepper on it, and we're fixing to eat it. Okay, y'all saw in the last video where she went crazy and bought all them seeds. Well, she's also bought some deep insert trays here, and then bought the tray with the, it's a whole sleeve of cups, or you can take it apart and have the individual cups instead of using styrofoam uh, that, that we've used in the past. And then also she's got the stakes where she can ride on whatever the fruit or vegetable is that we're planting. Here's my sunflower seeds and they've been planted exactly a week. And I've had a few of them come up. You can see some right there. And there's a single seed in each one of these cups. And this one here, if I can get to it, it had been up for two or three days. But then it sort of went stagnant and this fellow right here has really come out in two days uh, this is the one uh, out of the cups that might be the strongest and that's the end of this video we hope you like what you saw and if you do give us that thumbs up if you're a new viewer and not a subscriber I ask you to hit that subscribe button and ring that bell for notifications and we'll see y'all later